On a positive note tonight, it was an old, overgrown baseball field, but town leaders had a vision, a vision that involved vegetables. As our Kim Gable shows us, they're now reaping the rewards with a bounty of possibilities. Right next to the Hamilton Park playground in Turtle Creek, seeds of change are producing a harvest of community pride. Um, this used to be an old baseball field, right? Correct. Yeah, and before that it was a tennis court. Eileen Pickle gives us a tour of Home Plate Garden, where the very first seed was sown five years ago. These look like, are these eggplant? Eggplant and green peppers. Wow. A grant from Grow Pittsburgh financed the first two years, but now it's sustained by donations and volunteers. And, you know, if you don't have money, that's okay too. You know, it's whatever you want to take. And um, we really have had some very nice, generous people, <laughs> you know, and that makes up for the people who can't pay. From zucchini and tomatoes to cantaloupe and Brussels sprouts. It's kind of labor of love. <laughs> Danny Damico and Dale Bezeb are freshening up the berry patch. We don't have uh, any local grocery stores. I mean, we do have a small store that has canned goods, but no fresh produce. And customers line up at the farm stand here on Tuesdays and Saturdays. No, those are hot back there. They're spicy. We wanted to start here as the garden, as a community stepping stone to get families together. So while the crops are growing, neighbors are gathering. This takes repurpose to another level. And the kids are especially curious. And we bring them in, give them tours, let them pick the strawberries, some green beans, just to perk their interest of seeing how things grow. And they really do seem enthralled by it, so we're excited for that. Scoring those wins in more ways than one at Home Plate Garden on a positive note. And we want to hear your positive stories, and we want to feature them right here at 730. You can send us ideas at kdka.com. You just have to look for the blue background you see there with the yellow smiley face. It's about halfway down on the KDKA homepage.